Join me as I dive deep into the lives of the cast from Netflix's Monsters and uncover what really happened to them after the show. In this video, you'll explore the true story behind the Menendez brothers and how their infamous trial was adapted into Netflix's Monsters. The Menendez brothers faced a significant challenge in their trial, but what has happened to the actors who portrayed them since the show aired? The show's portrayal of the brothers' tumultuous relationship and the brutal murder of their parents sent shockwaves through the media and the public. The cast members stepped into their roles with incredible commitment, capturing the complexity of the real-life characters. But what drove them to take on these roles, and how did it impact their careers? Gus Halper, the talented actor who played Eric Menendez, came from a background in theater and television, landing small roles here and there before landing the part of a lifetime in Monsters. He was relatively new to the industry, but his performance in the show opened doors to new opportunities, including a recent recurring role in a popular TV series. Take a closer look at the careers of the cast members, including their past works, how Monsters impacted their careers, and any recent projects they've taken on. Gus's co-star, Anthony Welch, who played Lyle Menendez, also saw a surge in his career following the show's release, with multiple projects lined up in the coming years. Edie Falco, the talented actress who brought Leslie Abramson to life, has had a long and storied career, with numerous award-winning performances under her belt. Monsters was just another feather in her cap, and she continues to work on a wide range of projects, from film to television to theater. Damien Spangler, the talented actor who played Detective Zamora, has been working steadily in the industry, taking on a variety of roles in film, television, and theater. Monsters was a highlight of his career, and he continues to push himself creatively with each new project. Highlight the most surprising or notable developments in the lives of these actors, particularly any major successes or setbacks they've encountered post-show. One of the most exciting developments is Gus Halper's recent move to writing and producing, with a project currently in development. Another highlight is Edie Falco's continued commitment to social justice, using her platform to raise awareness and support for important causes. The cast members' dedication to their craft and their passion projects is truly inspiring. It's clear that the experience of working on Monsters had a profound impact on the cast, driving them to pursue new challenges and push themselves creatively. Recap the journey of the cast members and reflect on how their portrayals contributed to the public's understanding of the Menendez case. By bringing these characters to life, the cast of Monsters helped to humanize the story, making it more relatable and accessible to a wider audience. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the cast of Monsters, be sure to check out our other videos on true crime adaptations and share your thoughts in the comments below.